field here, so uh, hopefully we got some addition of some new players, so uh, hopefully it'll be just as good as last year, if not better. Uh, this year, my hype is uh, to win a game. Didn't win a game last year. <laughs> uh, if I can win a game this year, it'll be very successful. You know what, I'm just going to look back to the roots of the game and just play like I did year one. Yep, just go back and go all out. Well, last year I was kind of chubby. I lost a little bit of weight and <laughs> going with that skinny effect. <laughs> hoping that I can use that to my advantage. Excited to play all summer and maybe into the fall. And I just can't wait till we get the schedule figured out with baseball and all season guys. And it's going to be a fun year. Uh, you know, I've been losing a little bit of sleep at night, but uh, I'm getting through it. And uh, I think I'll be ready to go then, and hopefully everyone else is ready to go. It's going to be a, it's going to be a rough night of sleep. I'm going to be excited all night, ready to play, and uh, I just get excited. I can't really describe the feelings. It's kind of like the Dr. Pepper. <laughs> can't describe it. Well, that was a very inspirational event. You know, it just really made me want to earn one of those this year. Hopefully, I can make some plays, maybe win a few championships. See what we can do. Uh, but this year, you know, the SB is it's not a, it's not like a, it's like a, it'd be a goal, a great thing to get one. But I'm just out there to play the game. Well, now that there's an award ceremony, uh, I think a lot of people are going to be putting forth a little extra effort. But I'm just going to stick to uh, what I did last year. Well, you know, I like the intensity. A lot of these players come out every week, just play with intensity. I just like to take uh, take some notes from Andrew Schmidt. He's one of the most intense players I've ever played against. I was just surprised at the intensity. Um, I knew it was two on two football, but I never knew like the actual atmosphere of it. Very tense. Um, I don't think I've ever seen George that upset when he lost. I don't think he moved for an hour straight. So learn from your veterans. Yep. Just look up to those who've been in the league since the beginning and yeah, learn from example, I guess. Um, being one of the few homosexuals in, the <laughs> in an, in an all-male league, how do you overcome your desires to grab other players? <laughs> how do you think you'll overcome them? <laughs> I'd like to point out right now that I am not a homosexual. <laughs> not that there's anything wrong with that. But I am not one of them. And uh, you, sir, I, I am questioning your integrity of being here right now. <laughs> Over here, uh, Bud Sleelik from ESPN. So, uh, say your mom got hit in the chest by a snake. Uh, would you be willing to suck out the venom to win a small ball title? Uh, not with my mom, but I would with your wife. Uh, um, seeing as you had no success last year and you're a pretty hyped up player this year, uh, what do you say to the critics that um, think Nick Girard used performance-enhancing drugs and uh, banned substances in the offseason? Well, uh, I'll, I'll be subject to a test. You know, if that's what they want me to do, I'll do it. I'll prove them all wrong. You know, I'll go out there, I'll win games, and I'll show that I, want, I did it the right way. Mobile,